let me guess, they're going to be Gnostic texts. What a surprise. The Gospel of Judas is one of the many Gnostic texts discovered in Egypt. And like all the Gnostic texts, the theological ideas presented were contrary to the teachings of the apostles and the early Christian community. These second century Gnostic communities reinterpreted existing religious texts, including the Old Testament and various Christian writings to fit their particular worldview. In other words, they were heretics, and the Gospel of Judas wasn't written by Judas either. Another Gnostic text not accepted for the same obvious reasons that theology is contrary to what Christ and the Apostles taught. Also, Gnostic texts like the Testimony of Truth have no apostolic authority, nor were they accepted among early Christian communities. Same with the Gnostic Gospel of Thomas, it did not meet the criteria established by early Christian leaders for inclusion in the canon. And it was written somewhere in the 2nd century, so well after the time of the Apostles, unlike the four canonical Gospels that were written in the 1st century. If you just read a few excerpts from any of the Gnostic texts, you will very quickly realize it's a bunch of nonsense. <laughs> 